Hey, it's the Fish Guy with Something Fishy, and on today's episode of Fish Guy TV, we're gonna give you a tip to help keep your pond healthy. Pond salt is a product that should be added to your pond during the spring cleanout service. When you're filling your pond up for the first time for the year, you wanna add one scoop per 100 gallons. So in a pond like this, the scoop that comes in the container, you're gonna add 12 scoops to this size pond. It's a 1,200 gallon pond. Once you've done that, you should be good for the rest of the season. You shouldn't have to add salt to your pond. The reason is that as water evaporates and we lose water from the system, the salt doesn't. So the concentration of salt that we're gonna have in your pond at the doses I reviewed is about 3%. Your pond salt content should stay at 3% unless you have water loss or you're doing a water change, at which point you should add new salt to the pond based on the new amount of water being added. If you're adding just for evaporation, you don't have to worry about adding salt. Now let's say that you wanna use salt which can also be done as a medication for wounded fish, you wanna increase your salt content to 6%. You're gonna double the volume. So again, you would double the volume administered to your pond. So if you're already at 3% in a pond that's 1,200 gallons, to get another 3%, you should just have to add a, one scoop per 100 gallons. Now you can measure the concentration of salt by using a salt pen or a refractometer, both of which could be utilized within our store, we can test that water for you. The purpose of salt at the regular administered level of 3% is to help with gill function and help prevent parasites from infecting the fish. Parasites are in every environment and they are in your pond as well and the salt will help prevent and protect the fish from that along with our gill function. So don't forget to have salt in your pond, it'll be an important thing to help keep your fish and your pond healthy throughout the season.